Hello friends, happy Sabbath. I'm glad to be with you on this Sabbath day as we gather together in prayer and today as we often do, I want to offer a prayer about love. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, as we gather in prayer this morning, we pray for ourselves and our neighbors in the world. We begin with prayers of thankfulness for all that we have received, for all the blessings in our lives. Today we again pray for love, for more love. The prayers seem to be needed, more needed today than ever before. We make it complicated. You have said that the first commandment is that we love one another. We often try to define that on our own terms, but we know that you really meant love everyone. We just aren't as good at it as we should be. Lord, hear us as we pray this day. Guide us to love our neighbors, all of our neighbors. Guide us to seek equality for all. Guide us to be uncomfortable, to guide us to uncomfortable conversations that will allow an end to racism and inequality in the world. Guide us to be an instrument of your love, promoting an end to police violence and all violence in the world. Guide us to be an instrument for the end of systemic racism in our nation, our communities, and our church. Guide us to seek unity for our nation. Forgive our silence and guide us to speak. Forgive our inaction and guide us to act. Forgive our hate and guide us to love. Amen. Friends, our reading for today is text from Deuteronomy, what is commonly referred to as the Shema, from the sixth chapter of Deuteronomy. You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, and with all your soul, and with all your might. Keep these words that I am commanding you today in your heart. Recite them to your children, and talk about them when you are at home, and when you are away, when you lie down, and when you rise. Bind them as a sign on your hand, and fix them as an emblem on your forehead, and write them on the doorposts of your house and on your gates. Friends, this is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Have a blessed day. And remember to love one another.